Welcome to Photoshop Lab. Let's start creating this cover art by using elliptical market tool. Set the size of your selection, then add a gradient adjustment layer. Set the setting of your gradient, then hit OK. Convert it into Smart Object, then go to Filter, Blur Gallery. Select Path Blur. You can play around with the arrows and sliders, but ensure that the centered blur box is unchecked. If you're happy, then simply hit OK. Let's add some noise by going to Filter, Noise, and Add Noise. You can always resize the centered object or the eclipse by using the Ctrl plus T or the Transform tool. Place it under the text and elements. You can also change the color of your eclipse by using the U and Saturation tool. Pen tool, letter P. You can open the grid lines using this shortcut keys. Here you can play around, draw your own shape. But let me show you a simple shape that I have prepared for this video. After that, right click, make selection then add a solid color hit ok place it below your object open layer style add stroke sample the color of your eclipse or you can have whatever color that you want then add outer glow you can copy my setting or even play around if you want Hit OK. Then let's add some elements under your eclipse or in your background. Create clipping mask, clip it on the solid color. Add layer mask, then use brush tool to remove some areas that you want to remove. Remember, to choose black as your foreground color if your mask is on white then white if your mask is on black let's finalize our cover art by editing some elements then flattening our layers You can also add some color adjustment setting or color balance to play around with the overall mood of your cover art. And that's it. Once again, thank you so much for watching.